Hello everyone and welcome to another Lens Studio tutorial. In this video we are going to go over the call template that I have created and the basic concept of this is that when somebody taps the screen it'll start ringing like somebody's calling them and when they tap it again it'll open up a fake video. In this case we have my dog Ralphie who is not enjoying the tiny hands. Um, once the video is done, it'll go back up to the regular screen here, and that is really it. It's a fake FaceTime lens. So, if you want to try this template out yourself, all you have to do is go in the description below and download it from the link. So once you open it up, the first thing you're going to do is see uh, some of the notes here. I kind of created a step-by-step -step process. So the first thing you're going to want to do is create your own fake video. Um, a few things to note, you're going to want to make sure the video is 720 by 1280 in resolution. You're going to want to make sure it is an MP4 file type. And also that it's under about 3.5 megabytes. Now the best way to make sure that it is under 3.5 megabytes is by going to videosmaller.com. This is what I use to compress all of my videos really quickly. Um, if you have your own video compression software you can use that but that's just uh, one that I have found that works. Next you're going to want to get your own custom ringtone and this is optional if you don't want to have a ringtone in your lens you can just uncheck play ringtone and it'll just be silent. So just like the video you're going to want to make sure that your audio file is in the correct format. In this case, it is MP3 format. Uh, try and keep it under five seconds because it'll be looping. Then you're gonna want to import your own circular icon, like your profile icon that'll show up here. Um, you can edit this in like Photoshop or whatever uh, software you use. So once you have those three things, you just will go into the orthographic camera here and you'll see that there is a few things that say edit me the video this is where you're going to add your uh, your video in that you have imported make sure that autoplay is unchecked otherwise it'll just play automatically all the time if you want sound in your video make sure to drag the volume up to one so you're going to put that video in here you're going to add your new icon and put it right in here same thing with your ringtone just put it right in there and then in the call controller you're going to, again, add the video to that. You're going to change your username to whatever your username is. And then you're going to change the call duration. So you're going to want to go to your actual video, check it in the inspector, and see here it says it is about 10 seconds long. So I just wrote 10 in the duration. And that is basically what is going to be the time when the video shuts off and it goes back to the regular screen so if I did like just a five second video and I changed the username here you're gonna see it says snap user I'm gonna answer it and instead of 10 seconds it's going to cut off pretty early and then go back up to the regular see so yeah that is about it if you have any questions leave a comment and I would love to see what you can make with this have fun everyone